A husband charged with killing his wife in front of their young children, and now he's on the run. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm David Amelotti. Hazelwood Police want you to take a close look at these photos here on your screen of Gregory Smith III and the Dodge Durango he may be driving. Police say Smith should be considered armed and dangerous. News 4's Russell Kinsall reports on the search for the suspect. Hazelwood police described the homicide scene as tragic and gruesome. Neighbors woke to see flashing lights in their neighborhood, but had no idea a brutal killing had taken place while they slept. I don't know what happened, but um, I just hope they catch him. It's, it's horrible. Neighbors woke to flashing lights at 801 Lightwood Drive. It was about 445. I saw two ambulances and a fire truck at that point. Police say a husband brutally killed his wife inside the house in front of their children, an infant and a child under 10. We received a 911 call uh, from a child indicating that there was a disturbance at the residence and that his mom was uh, seriously injured. The victim is identified as 37-year-old Christina Garcia. Police say she was beaten, stomped, and stabbed. The coroner has not made their determination yet, but we believe that uh, she was probably, uh, a knife was used to kill her. The victim's husband, 40-year-old Gregory Smith III, is charged with first-degree murder, armed criminal action, and endangering the welfare of a child. I mean, it's surprising. This is a quiet neighborhood. I mean, you wouldn't expect to hear about something like that in this neighborhood. He was he was carrying an AK-47. Yeah, him and his buddy were. Neighbors tell of a frightening encounter with Smith. One found his dog out loose and tried to return the dog, but said Smith slammed the door in his face. He comes out with an AK-47 and walks over to me, and I was gardening, and I got up, and I was like, what are you going to do? He goes, where's my dog? Smith drives a dark gray Dodge Durango with Washington plates C21593P with a black right rear wheel. If you see him or the SUV, you're asked to call police or Crime Stoppers. Police say this event will be traumatizing to those two young children. Detectives have been in contact with both sets of grandparents about taking custody of the children. At the Hazelwood Police Department, Russell Kinsall, News 4.